At least one in three primary students will have received a crucial first dose by the time they enter the classroom for Term 1. It follows confirmation all 51,000 air purifiers promised for Victorian schools will be in place in time for students to return. State political reporter Mark Santamartino. Of all the tricks to make vaccinating kids easier... All right, look at Mum. Where's Mum? Having Murphy the support dog at school and the promise of a bravery bag packed with toys and treats is an easy sell to keen seven-year-olds like Alex. I think it was good how they asked me before they just did it. Knowing that we could get it done around the corner really quickly, we came in, we booked early and it was just seamless. Parents Cass and Chris got their boosters too, kicking off the 1,000 adults and 1,000 more students. Furbank Grammar will vaccinate on campus with help from TLC Healthcare. We want to make it as easy and as non-threatening as possible for the children, so bringing them here on site means they feel a bit more comfortable. This has been in the making now for the best part of two months. The only difference is we, we do rat test every individual that comes through. Starting today, kids can get vaccinated at Carlton's Royal Exhibition Building too. There are more than a 1,000 appointments on offer for the next week, with even more available at kid-friendly sites at Melton, Caroline Springs and Campbellfield, Sandown, Cranbourne and Sun. Sunshine. Even if you're a bit nervous, it doesn't really hurt. Thanks to another 4,337 kids like Alex, 32% of 5 to 11-year-olds have had their first dose. Almost one in three Victorians over 18 have had their booster, with the government encouraging but not mandating staggering start and drop-off times when school begins. It's a common sense, sensible measure that will allow schools to open and to stay open. The biggest issue isn't drop-off and pick-up. The biggest issue is classrooms. The Labor government promised air purifiers for every classroom. The simple question is, have they delivered on that, yes or no? According to the Health Minister, all 51,000 promised will be installed by the start of a hopefully normal Term 1. Homeschooling was OK, but it wasn't the best because I'd rather be with my friends. We're doing everything we can to get them back into school and, and have a great, great school year. Mark Santomartino, Nine News.